Yvonne Beerman. Now, I told you that today we were going to talk about meditation. Now, a lot of people think that meditation is a woo-woo, hooey thing. Well, you know what? Successful people, people who lead countries, they meditate. They might not call it meditation, but what they do is they spend time alone with no distractions and just set an intention for the information, for the answers, for the solution, for whatever it is they're doing for the decision they need to make in their life that day. So meditation is all about saying, well, this is going on in my life and I need to know what is the best step for me to take. Or maybe it's, I want to create this relationship. What do I need to do or who do I need to become to make that happen? So meditation doesn't mean you need a special room or special equipment. You don't need special music. Meditation just means being by yourself without distractions. You can do it standing up. You can do it sitting down. You can do it going for a walk. You can do it with your eyes open, which I highly recommend if you're going for a walk. You can do it with your eyes closed. You don't need special music. You do whatever feels good to you. There are different ways to do it. Some people like someone to tell them and lead them on what's called a guided meditation. And they're saying, you know, your body's doing this now. Look at what you're seeing. Go along this path. Cross over the bridge. Whatever it is. Some people like a guided meditation. If you're setting an intention to get answers, it's a little bit challenging to do that if somebody's talking in your ear the whole time. So, another way to do it is like a candle flame. I used to, I started meditating with a candle flame, and just looking into that flame and getting lost in the flame, it's a little hard to explain, but that's what happened for me. And you can also chant some kind of, well, I don't really mean chant. You don't have to do it out loud. If you want to, you can. But some word that has no meaning for you. A lot of people like to use the word OM. OM is the vibration, the sound of the earth. And as a meaning for a word, it doesn't. Therefore, it doesn't distract you. So when little thoughts go flitting by, by saying, say it up here, you don't say it out loud. By saying the word OM, it's a way of bringing you back and centering. different from your normal world, if that's your intention, whatever it is, you do. So I congratulate you for making it through all 17 secrets. Of course, watching them probably hasn't changed your life. How many of these secrets have you applied? Because I guarantee you, if you apply just a handful of them, you will change how your relationships are running. And when you change how your relationships are running, you will change your life. You may have heard that you are like your five closest friends. So now there's a reason for going down below and clicking the like button and sharing with everybody you know because there are more people in your circle thinking like you think, acting like you act. The easier it is for you to stay on track, the easier it is for you to create and maintain those amazing relationships because there's no question about it. When you are living with amazing relationships, your life's going to look a whole lot different than it does now. Now, come on back every day because I'll be here every day. And if you've got a question or you have something you want to share, go on down and you leave a reply, make a comment. And I guarantee if you're asking a question or you're leaving a comment, there's somebody else's whose eyes are going to see it and be awfully glad you did because it's something they needed to read or hear in the moment. So I don't have all the answers for everybody, and I know you have a lot of answers that I want to know too. So come on back every day. I will definitely be posting at least one new video every week. I look forward to getting to know you. Tell me where you are in your life and what you want and what you're looking for in relationships. Let's make that difference for you because you know when you make the difference, those around you, they have to change too. It's impossible for you not to. And as you change, yourself and then you change the people around you. The change goes out to the community, to the country, the whole world changes. Let's make that difference. Let's make this world look the way we really want to. Thank you for joining me and how to have an amazing relationship.
situations. It completely changed my life.